What is up everybody? My name is Justin. This is Forever Self Employed and in today's video we are going to try and clean our back patio concrete without a pressure washer. That's correct. We're going to try to get this concrete clean without using any pressure whatsoever. I wanted to do a bit of an experiment. I've been playing around with this soft wash formula and for those of you who don't know, soft wash formula is pool essentials, Dawn soap, and water. The current formula I'm using in my backpack at the time of this recording is a half gallon of pool essentials, two gallons of water, and two ounces of Dawn soap. I'm not sure exactly what that equates to in SH, but I'm sure you guys could do the math on that if you want to. Anyway, I figured people don't always have pressure washers, but sometimes they want to get things clean. And I want to see just how effective this mixture is. So I went ahead and put it on my dad's back patio. He's currently renting this property. So he wanted to get the back patio clean, and I said, you know what, this would be a great video experiment. Um, so first off, I just went ahead and sprayed the pool essential mixtures on the patio. I left it there for about 10 to 15 minutes. I just wanted to see what the chemical could do by itself. Um, and then when I came back and sprayed with the water hose, I noticed that it really wasn't taking off as much as I wanted it to. It was doing a little bit, but I figured I'd help it out a little bit. So I got this broom here. As you can see, I'm basically just sweeping off the dirt. I mean, if you just put water on this and you try to sweep off this dirt, good luck. But with the pool essentials, it's really eating up all that algae. And I just came through with the broom and it just, you know, cleaned it off very nicely. And this is just a house broom that you would use to sweep up, you know, dust around the house and everything. It's not even like a good, you know, they have those brooms that you use whenever you wash your car. That would probably be a better broom for this type of, you know, cleaning, for this patio cleaning. But, you know, I just had to use what I had. And in any case, if somebody's around their house, they don't have a pressure washer, they don't have a certain type of broom, they can make it work with just some things that they have around the house, you know, bleach, Dawn soap, and water. So that's kind of what I wanted to do. I wanted to test out the mixture, see how well it does. Um, it's just very fascinating to me um, how well this mixture actually works. I've never... Before in the past, I never really tried to use mixtures when I was pressure washing or anything. So now I kind of want to test it on all kind of stuff. I will have a video coming in the future, and I'm going to see if it can take the algae and stuff off of fences. I want to see if I can restore like my mom's fence using just the chemical mixture and a hose. And if I can, that'll be a great video. So stay tuned for that. If you haven't already, subscribe and hit that like button. I don't know what you're waiting for. So as you guys can see... Um, when I went, first of all, I just sprayed the entire patio with the mixture that I had, and then I came through with the brush, as I was just talking about. It really took up a lot of that dirt, a lot of that algae that was on there. I sprayed off everything, and then what I'm doing now is I'm just coming back for a second round. So I'm just retreating the entire concrete, um, and then I'll let that sit there for a little while, probably about five to ten minutes, just kind of let it eat at that algae a little bit. And then I'm coming back at it again with the broom, just sweeping up all the little leftover, you know, dirt remnants, getting everything out, getting it very, very clean. And at the end of these clips, I will have the before and after pictures. And let me tell you, these came out incredibly well. I was very surprised at how well this came out. So if you have a back patio and it's dirty and you don't, you know, have the money for a pressure washer, you don't feel like buying a pressure washer, I mean... This could definitely be a good substitution for that. I mean, obviously, there's you can see the brick lining um, by the sliding glass doors. Obviously, if I had a pressure washer, I would knock all that off. You can't really do that too much with the chemicals. I guess if I had a small brush, maybe I could. But um, for this video, I was just doing the patio. But in any case, if you only had the chemicals and you only had a broom, you could get your patio clean. So as you can see, I went ahead and did the second chemical spray. I let it sit. I went back with the broom just to kind of clean up all the little leftovers. And here I'm coming back and I'm just spraying it all off clean. And let me tell you, it came out beautifully. Um, like I said, I'm going to be doing a fence video in the future. And also, if you guys can see the swing set in the back, um, we, we were already, we were tearing that down. My dad's renting this property, so we had to do a little maintenance to it. I'm going to have a video of us taking down the entire swing set, so be on the lookout for that. My name is Justin. This is Forever Self-Employed. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and I will catch you in the next video. Until then, hustle hard and get that money, baby. Peace.